Hey everyone, this is Fabrizio Cross from Electrom Light Electric Vehicle, and today I'm going to tell you about the Electrom's steering system. We've had a lot of questions about the steering system, and so I figured it was time to do a little detailed uh, explanation. Now we're filming outdoors, so it's a little bright, and uh, Mother Nature is supplying the bird noises, so hopefully you can hear me over, over that. Um, so, the recumbent long wheelbase understeer system is what the Electrom is using. Uh, uh, we didn't come up with this by ourselves. It's been in existence. The concept of an understeer long wheelbase recumbent bicycle has been around for a long time. We've just done a few extra things to make it that much better. And I think it's worth mentioning that this system is applicable to both recumbent bicycles and light electric vehicles as well as feet forward motorcycles. It's a really great way to uh, decouple the steering from the fork and give the rider a more comfortable position. And one of the reasons why I really like the understeer position, especially when it comes to uh, heavier recumbents like the Electrom, is it makes getting on and off the vehicle very easy. You don't have to contort your way around a steering column or you don't have to have this steering handlebar right up in your knees. Um, it's a very nice, comfortable, ergonomic position. Your handlebars are right by your side in a very natural position. And in the case of a feet forward motorcycle, I think it would be a great way to also improve the ability to comfortably get on and off of these types of vehicles. So the Electrum uses a remote steer, meaning the handlebars are not connected to the fork. And we are doing something a little different than most. We are using 3 16 aircraft cable in a loop around a pair of pulleys to transmit your steering forces from the handlebars up to the fork. And this works really well for a couple of reasons. One, it is almost completely free of friction. On a two-wheel vehicle, you really can't have any kind of friction in your steering system because it messes up your ability to make micro connections, corrections while you're on the road. Um, and the other thing that we're doing that's quite unique is our cable fixing point on the fork is a quill style system that goes in on the bottom of the fork crown. And this is quite nice because it means you can affix it to any fork that has a hollow steerer tube. Uh, different forks may have different steerer tube diameters, but you can always modify for that. And uh, in our case, what we've designed it to work on is a standard inch and an eighth, 26 inch mountain bike fork because they are readily available. And that way, if you crash your Electrom and bend your fork, you can remove that old fork and replace it with a new fork uh, and just swap the steering system in. And you don't have to machine any special parts or get a specially modified fork. And in fact, that has been one of the central tenets of the Electron project from the beginning is wherever possible, we're using standard off the shelf bicycle or e-bike parts because we want our users to be able to replace those parts anytime they need to without going through us. So we've got our driven pulley up on the fork the cable has a tensioner in it, which allows us to tension the cable and make sure it's nice and snug. And adjustments are made by loosening off the cables permanently attached to the pulley, but you can loosen off the pulley and adjust it in relation to the fork to do small adjustments on your steering. The cable then runs down through a set of deviation pulleys, which are on bearings, so very little friction. And then it is running into another pulley that is attached to the steer tube of the handlebars. And the handlebars are just a simple piece of inch and eighth aluminum tubing. That allows us to use standard mountain bike uh, stems. And the upright handlebars are simply a extra long mountain bike handlebar cut in half. And once again, we're using these standard off the shelf parts so that if you have an accident and you bend one of these things, you can easily replace it. And these are downhill mountain bike handlebars. They are more than strong enough for the job. So that's it. That is the Electrom remote steer steering system. And uh, I should mention that we uh, did explore getting a patent on this system. There were enough other examples of similar systems in existence uh, 
already that prevented us from getting us a patent, but that's good news for all of you out there because it means you can go ahead and use this system in your designs and not have to worry about getting sued for patent infringement. You certainly won't get sued by us. Um, so once again, this is Fabrizio Cross from Electrome LEV. Thank you very much for watching.